that was part of what Cave Rave is all about, like getting back to that raw state where, you know, you were in a cave maybe singing or playing a rhythm and hearing the echo and being sort of transfixed by it and trying to turn your visions, you know, into something that can be remembered and recorded and, and learnt from by other people, you know. Happy spinning, clapping, laughing, dancing in the blackness of magic. Get it, have it, bag it, throw yourself on the airplane and fly like magic. No sleep, no chance, no need, forget about it. One life, live free, big dreams, we're all about them. That's where it all started for us and we thought, at the very least, let's go and be inspired by the place and take it from there, you know? There was um, like a sense that, yes, we needed to like continue this opera that, that we'd sort of become a part of. You and me, no one else, nothing else but us right now. And I need nothing else, no one else but you and I. And it ain't me, it ain't you. It was there where we started talking about, you know, thinking about all the things we've been discussing between us for the last couple of years and and uh, the sort of higher sort of spiritual or like intellectual or philosophical viewpoints that we we felt that we were coming to less about like um, the specifics of Basque culture and Basque music even though those are still part of it you can't tell me out of that one again yeah, like we gave ourselves the general themes in the album like the, the feeling of universality like um, you know, uh, eternal oneness, um, being in touch with not only your own spirit, but that of those around you. And also the idea of riding the same wave together. Nothing else but us right now, and I ain't need nothing else, no one else but you and I. And it ain't me, it ain't you, it's only us, it's us right now. You're finding it, take it, take it in, it's all here. I think it's just interesting to think about these things and to to you know, explore these ideas of like the spirit and connect, connectedness and like to try and get out of our, you know, for most of our listeners, I'm sure they're living in the Western world like we are. But at the same time, we really want people to enjoy the songs as fun songs to listen to and to sing along to and to enjoy your life with and to share experiences with, you know? This time we really were able to you know, combine our influences across the whole album and meld the, you know, these different ideas we had like, much more seamlessly and much smoother um, to create something that sounds much grander and much bigger and like, at, at the core of it are you know, much better songs, we think. You know? It was, a, it was a, you know, not a short process, but a definitely a fruitful one and we've got lots to look back on and, and say, well, there has been a great development over this period, not just where we left off with the last album. Else. With our music, we hope, you know, when we play, that we're like providing enjoyment and entertainment and love to an extent to people. And like, that's a good feeling to be spreading a you know, positive message and to, you know, you, you get that love back. You